this two minute demonstration, I'm going to show you how to manage workstations for file short. I'm going to start a file short here. And there's workstations button right there, manage. And we're going to go ahead and add one real quick. We have 10 licenses, zero managed right now, so we'll add a workstation. We're just going to click one from the list. And we'll go ahead and start this up because it takes a few seconds. And this is kind of a neat option for file short, I mean, for workstation protection. And what it does is hide the file short service. And what this will do is, is on this computer, file short will tell uh, when it gets configured and pull the settings down from this master machine. It will replace the task manager with a Bystorm task manager, which will hide the file short service. This will, in essence, protect the service from being killed via task manager, which is something that you want to have, uh, especially if your users are administrators on their own computer, they can kill any task. Unlike if they're not administrators, they can only kill the tasks that they own. Uh, looks like we're already managed. Another option, is, which is really kind of nice, is this server file wall. And what it does is actually blocks file shares from being seen on this computer, from being seen on any computer that is not running FileSure. And the reason why that's done is because if somebody's running, uh, let's say if somebody has access to important documents, uh, you know, architectural drawings, let's say, and they actually go out of Best Buy and they buy a laptop and they just bring it in, plug it into the network, add it to the network, and off they go. They can just copy files all day long since it doesn't have FileSure. By using the FileSure, I mean the server file wall, they can't get on the on the network. They may be able to log on, but they can't see any of the shares, so they can't copy any of the files. Now that we've managed this machine, it'll the list will show up. Uh, it'll show up all over the place. Like for instance, we hit the drop down. You can see that the SAT uh, SAT take USA is there. Or if we come over here to like the report screen and we select the machines, you'll see it's there. Um, it's going to show up everywhere the managed machines are used. We can also that's how we we set it up. Query, and if we want to remove it, we just click removal and we hit the deploy button and it's going to stop it and then it's going to uninstall it and then it's going to release your license back. Mark the unmanaged. That's how you manage it.